Hi, boys and girls. We are traveling today. We always start with where we live, which we know is in the United States of America, also called the USA or America. And we live in the state of Illinois, which is right there by that blue finger that looks like a blue finger coming down. That's Lake Michigan. And today we're traveling to another island. You know how yesterday we traveled to Hawaii? Today we're traveling to another island, but this one is off the coast of India. Here's the country of India, which you might have heard of. And we're traveling to this grayish color country down here that's called Sri Lanka. Okay, Sri Lanka is where we're going today. We're gonna meet a little girl, I'll introduce you to her. It says, hi, Merry Christmas from the island of Sri Lanka. My name is Mali. I live in the city of Kandy. Isn't Kandy a great name for a city? I have a sister named Sharmari. Sharmari and I do lots of things together. We talk to the beautiful parrots that live in the coconut palms by our house. Sometimes the parrots talk back. And we weave place mats for our mother out of reeds our dad gathers by the river. But one of our favorite things to do is to make paper chains at Christmas time. Green and yellow and blue and red paper chains like these. We hang some of our paper chains on our Christmas tree at home and we take some of our chains to church to hang on the tree of life. That's what we call the Christmas tree at church. We help our mother make some other decorations too. Pretty paper flowers and big red bells and soft cotton snowflakes. Aren't they beautiful? On Christmas morning, while it's still very dark, we light torches and join many people walking down our long hill to the Christmas sunrise service. We are very quiet then, boom, boom, boom. Drums beat in the distance, flash, flash. Fireworks light up the sky. Inside, the church is all dark except for the light from our burning torches. There you can see the bright paper chains we made. Everyone reads the wonderful Christmas story from the Bible out loud together, just as the sun peeks over the top of the hill. Can you say Merry Christmas the way we do in our language to meal? Kruzma far to doll. Kruzma far to doll. Maybe you can make a beautiful paper chain for your Christmas tree. I will tell you how in the back of this book. It's really easy and fun. I wish I could be there to do it with you. Merry Christmas and goodbye from your friend, Molly in Sri Lanka. Cruise my fur to doll. All right, so that was Molly. And today you guys are going to make a paper chain. So I'm gonna share my screen real quick here. And I'm gonna show you how to do it. All right, so the materials you need were found in that brown paper bag. Okay, there's six red strips, six green strips, and you're gonna need your glue stick. That's all you're gonna need today, okay? It doesn't matter which color you start with, but we're gonna try to make a red, green pattern, or it could be green, red, whatever. Okay, so here's what you do. You take one of your strips and you make a small circle of glue down here, okay? Then you make a circle and you stick it, okay? Just like that, you make a ring. Make sure you're not gluing it together like this. You don't want it to look like a raindrop or a teardrop, okay? It should be a circle. All right, and now I started with red, so my next color is gonna be green. So what I do is I take my green and I slip it through, and then I do the same thing. I put glue on the end, little circle of glue, and I close it up like a circle. See that? Okay, now I did red, green, now I'm back to red. I have to make sure to loop it through the green circle. And again, I'm just gonna put a dollop of glue at the bottom there, make a circle. You gotta kind of push it at the end so it doesn't pop open. And then don't forget to slide it through and we keep changing colors, red, green, red, green, red, green. And you're gonna do all of these till you run out of strips, okay? 
and you will have a beautiful Christmas paper chain like Molly made. Now you can do whatever you want with this. You can hang it up in your room as a decoration. You could put it on your Christmas tree as a garland. Okay, whatever you'd like to do with it. We usually at school, what we do when we're in school and we make this is we put all the paper chains together and we make a big gigantic paper chain that we hang from the ceiling and we drape it going all around the room. Looks really, really cool. You could do something like that too. If you wanted to, you could even cut more strips if you have paper at home and make different color paper chains. You could even just do white ones. Those are really pretty too with just white paper. All different ideas, okay? But you're gonna keep going. I don't know if you can see my paper chain right here. Okay, it's getting long. And you're gonna keep going till you run out of paper. Okay, there's six red ones. You should have six red and six green. Okay, well, I hope you enjoy making your paper chains and I will see you later, my friends. Take care. Bye-bye.